As frigid temperatures make their way into Northeast Kansas, the Topeka Zoo is staying open. Staff have been preparing to keep the animals comfortable for quite some time. 13's Callie Holthouse met with zoo officials today to see how. Yeah, David, several other zoos in the area have shuttered their doors as temperatures continue to drop, but not the Topeka Zoo. Officials say they prepare weeks in advance to be ready when the cold sets in. Zoo officials say they strive to give the animals as much choice as possible during these freezing temperatures. We provide a warm indoor area for them while still giving them access to their outside areas and then they can decide what they want to do. Tropical animals are moved indoors, but those native to North America can venture outside if they like. A re really good example of that would be our black bear. So uh, her name is Val. What we do is we have a den outside that she has dug under a log that she will sometimes uh, den in over winter, but we've also made a den space in her indoor area with some straw to keep it warm, and that way she can decide if she wants to den outside in the den that she actually dug herself or inside in the one we made for her. Preparing for extreme cold takes some planning ahead. We really rely on weather forecasts. We look ahead and when we see, you know, like the upcoming Arctic blast that's going to hit, we'll usually start prep work. Uh, at least a week or two before that if we need to do anything extra. That includes covering doors and windows, checking the temperature of indoor habitats regularly, and using heated water bowls. Maloney says there are still ways to enjoy the zoo without freezing. Uh, this time of the year is the best time to enjoy our more, more some of our indoor areas more. For example, our rainforest, um, our bug zoo, uh, our new giraffe and friends area here where you can, you can see our giraffe hanging out in the barn, um, our Camp Cowabunga area where we have a porcupine who likes to hang out there and our potus monkeys. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a really good time to appreciate the indoor areas. The Topeka Zoo is open and so is the Emporia Zoo, but the Sedgwick County and Sunset Zoos are closed for the time being.